Hey guys, my name is Aaron Hannon and today I'm going to be showing you how to create a Pikachu cake but more importantly how to turn it into a Pikachu Pennywise cake. Let's get started. And now before we get into it, make sure you hit that like button and hit that notification bell so that you can see all the videos I create as they go up. Now, two years ago, I created a Pikachu cake and somebody just commented that they wanted me to create a Pikachu Pennywise cake. I kind of just remembered right then and there that I had one. Now, when I was creating this Pikachu cake, I realized that I probably wouldn't do another Pikachu cake because there's so many other Pokemon, you guys. So after I finished creating this bomb cake, I decided to give it three Halloween costumes. And Pennywise is one of them. This is definitely one of the few videos that I like to revisit and watch just because I'm very surprised at how well this Pikachu cake came out. And it was definitely one of my stepping stones to creating a double-sided cake. And I know I'm missing some Pikachu details. You guys won't let me forget it, but it's fine. I made my peace with it. It's okay. If you want to see the original Pikachu video, there are links for you in the description box. I'll put one in the comments as well. You won't see the costumes, but there's a little bit more depth and explanation of how to create my Pikachu cake. Now once I finished with this Pikachu cake, I gave it its first costume. I've sprinkled some coconut shavings that I dyed black with some food coloring onto my cake board. And then I gave it a witch's cape, a cute orange bow, a broom, and a cute witch's hat. I got this costume from looking at Google Images. <laughs> There's so many Pikachus dressed up just like this. But this is the first cake that I saw. After I was finished with my witch cake, I took off all of the witch elements and added on a, a bib and two panels of black fondant on the sides to create a cake. I think my favorite part of this was the widow's peak, just because it looks so cute. I don't care how sharp those fangs are, he's not scary at all. And I took off all of my Dracula elements and placed on all of my Pennywise ones. I'm just starting with his buttons, giving him that signature color. Now this hair is kind of why this is just fondant art and not a cake because there's just way too much fondant to create this hair. And the fondant to cake ratio is like all over the place right now. <laughs> now, my favorite thing about this cake was just adding all of the Pennywise makeup elements. And I'm really proud of this. Man, I love this cake. Even though it is mostly fondant, I don't care. I served it at my birthday party. My birthday is October 26th, and so it always ends up being a Halloween themed birthday party. And everyone at the party thought it was really cool, even though it only served like three people. And most of those people were just eating like huge chunks of fondant. <laughs> now, after I created my double-sided Pennywise cake, you haven't seen it, you need to watch it. I looked back at my Pikachu Pennywise and realized that I wanted it to be more scary. But because this was a two-year-old cake and all I had was the footage and the pictures, I decided that I was just going to Photoshop it. So either I spend, what, six more hours making another Pikachu cake or I spend 30 minutes Photoshopping the face. So I took my Pikachu Pennywise and the scary side of my double-sided Pennywise cake. I flipped it so the light shined on the same side as my Pikachu Pennywise, cropped its eyes because that was the only part I was going to work on, and then just morphed the shape of the eyes and the nose so it matched my Pikachu. And I blended the side so that it would fit on my Pikachu, and then colored it yellow to match my Pikachu skin. I recolored the red in the makeup as well as the white in his eyes, and voila! My brand new Pikachu Pennywise cake was complete. Doesn't that look bomb? I saved so much time and so much cake just because I photoshopped it. I am extremely proud of all three of these Pikachu costumes. They look so cute. And I know the amount of cake is like extremely small, but I'm totally happy with just calling this fondant art. Now I'm curious, which one of these Pikachus is your favorite? Do you like the Pikachu witch? Do you like the Dracula costume? The Pennywise costume? or the scarier Pennywise Pikachu cake. 
I've got a ton of Halloween cakes on this channel, so make sure you will check out my double side cakes as well as the cute and scary series that I just started. I hope you guys enjoyed this. I love you. I will see you very soon. Peace!